Africa, a continent teeming with life, bursting with natural wealth and biodiversity, from the gold mines of South Africa to the oil fields of Nigeria, from the cocoa plantations of Côte d'Ivoire to the diamond mines of Botswana, the riches beneath Africa's soil are undeniable and vast. Yet this abundance of resources stands in stark contrast to the reality of widespread poverty that plagues many African nations, creating a perplexing dichotomy. The question arises, why is Africa, a continent so richly endowed, still grappling with such deep-rooted economic challenges and social inequalities? This paradox of plenty is not a tale of simple misfortune or lack of potential. It is a multifaceted issue. It's a complex narrative woven from threads of history, politics and global economics, each playing a significant role. It's a story of colonial exploitation, leaving lasting scars on the continent's development trajectory, scars that are still healing. It's a story of corrupt governance, where resources intended for the many end up lining the pockets of a few, perpetuating inequality. It's a story of unfair trade practices, where African nations are often forced to sell their raw materials cheaply while importing expensive finished goods, creating an economic imbalance. It's a story of inadequate infrastructure and limited access to education, hindering the growth of industries and skilled labor, essential for sustainable development. To understand Africa's economic realities, we must delve into this complex interplay of factors, recognizing the historical injustices and systemic barriers that continue to impede progress, while also acknowledging the resilience and potential of its people. The specter of colonialism looms large over Africa's economic narrative, casting a shadow that refuses to fade. European powers, driven by greed and a sense of entitlement, carved up the continent with little regard for its people, exploiting its vast resources and subjugating its people for their gain, leaving a legacy of exploitation. This period of forced extraction left deep scars on the African psyche and its economic structures, altering the course of its history. Colonial powers established extractive institutions designed to siphon off resources with little regard for long-term development or the well-being of the local populations, focusing solely on their own enrichment. They created systems of forced labor, displacing communities and disrupting traditional economic systems, causing long-lasting damage. This exploitation left African nations ill-prepared for independence lacking the necessary infrastructure, skilled workforce, and diversified economies needed for sustainable growth and development. The legacy of colonialism continues to cast a long shadow over Africa's economic landscape, perpetuating cycles of poverty, underdevelopment, and economic struggles that persist to this day. Governance plays a pivotal role in translating resource wealth into broad-based prosperity ensuring that the benefits of natural resources reach all citizens. However, many African nations are plagued by weak governance, rampant corruption, and a significant lack of transparency in their institutions. This toxic mix creates an environment where resources are mismanaged, stolen, or funneled into the hands of a select few, leaving the majority of the population mired in poverty and despair. Corruption acts as a silent killer of development, eroding trust in institutions, discouraging foreign investment, and significantly hindering economic growth and progress. It creates an uneven playing field where connections and bribes often matter more than merit and hard work, stifling innovation and fair competition. When leaders prioritize personal gain over the public good, the consequences are devastating, perpetuating a vicious cycle of poverty, inequality, and social unrest. Africa's relationship with the global market has often been characterized by exploitation and unfair trade practices. Many African nations remain dependent on exporting raw materials, often at low prices, while importing expensive manufactured goods. This unfavorable balance of trade perpetuates a cycle of dependency, hindering industrialization and economic diversification. Furthermore, developed nations often impose trade barriers, tariffs, and subsidies that disadvantage African producers, making it difficult for them to compete in the global marketplace. This lack of access to fair and equitable trade opportunities limits Africa's ability to fully harness its economic potential. Beyond resources, the building blocks of progress. 
Addressing Africa's economic challenges requires looking beyond its resource wealth and investing in the fundamental building blocks of sustainable development. This includes prioritizing education to empower future generations with the knowledge and skills needed to thrive in a globalized economy. Investing in healthcare is crucial to creating a healthy and productive workforce. While developing robust infrastructure is essential for connecting markets, facilitating trade and attracting foreign investment. Moreover, fostering innovation and entrepreneurship can unlock the creativity and drive of Africa's people, leading to the creation of new industries and job opportunities. Case Studies and Contradiction From Oil to Despair Nigeria, despite being Africa's largest oil producer, grapples with widespread poverty, unemployment and a lack of basic infrastructure. This stark contradiction highlights how even abundant resource wealth can fail to translate into prosperity when plagued by corruption, mismanagement and a lack of economic diversification. Similarly, the Democratic Republic of Congo, rich in minerals like cobalt and diamonds, remains one of the poorest countries in the world, ravaged by conflict, corruption and exploitation. These examples underscore the urgent need for good governance, responsible resource management, and equitable global partnerships to break the cycle of poverty and unleash Africa's true potential. Charting a new course investing in Africa's future. Africa's economic transformation requires a multifaceted approach, driven by both internal reforms and a more just and equitable global order. African governments must prioritize good governance, transparency and accountability, creating an environment that attracts investment, fosters innovation and empowers its citizens. Investing in education, healthcare and infrastructure is crucial for building a strong foundation for sustainable growth. Equally important is the need for fair trade practices, debt relief and technology transfer from developed nations to create a more level playing field in the global marketplace. A tapestry of hope reclaiming Africa's narrative. Despite the challenges, Africa's story is not defined by despair. Across the continent, a new generation of leaders, entrepreneurs and activists is emerging, determined to rewrite the narrative and chart a new course for their nations. From the bustling tech hubs of Lagos and Nairobi to the innovative agricultural initiatives taking root across the continent, Africa is brimming with potential waiting to be unlocked. By addressing the root causes of poverty, investing in its people, and demanding a more just global order, Africa can overcome its challenges and claim its rightful place as a beacon of prosperity and progress. <laughs>